Yeah, guys, so back what I was saying. Well, friends like Wendy, you don't need no enemies. You know, that was wrong if Nene confided in her and told her that, you know, Greg was allegedly, you know, having an affair on Nene and he allegedly has, you know, a baby or has someone pregnant. But that was not Nene's, that was not, excuse me, that was not Wendy's business to spread, you know. She was so dramatic about it. She was like, guys, like, Nene, you know, she texted me this morning and was like, I'm quitting. And, you know, so we basically thinking that she's saying that um, Nene is quitting Real Housewives of Atlanta. But now some of um, some of the uh, the alleged, you know, excuses or something or some of the comments was that you know, Greg was having an affair on her and Nene really wanted to um, divorce Greg. But then um, he was diagnosed with cancer. So that was her reason for staying. And that's why they were saying Nene used to treat Greg so mean, even though, you know, he was diagnosed with cancer because she knew of his um, alleged affair and she was mad about it. But, you know... She did her wifely duties and still stayed with her husband because, you know, you know, of course, cancer is a scurry situation and she didn't just want to leave him like that being a stow. He had a disease, but that wasn't, I don't know if Nene and Wendy concocted this, you know, little plan to get people to view Real Housewives of Atlanta or what, because it did seem a little thought out, like Wendy was so dramatic. You know, like, oh, my gosh. And I talked to Nene, and she was like, you know, she's quitting. And, you know, guys, you will understand. 